ass just to get around the corner. Oh my god, are you kidding me right now? Frustrating. Like the speed of sound. What is going on guys? This is Bullet Train HD here and welcome back to the channel to some Gran Turismo 6. This game is not dead yet because I said it's not anyway. If you guys don't know already, subscribe, hit that like button for more Gran Turismo 6 videos like this. Um, this is just a random video because I felt like doing it. We're going to run some laps. Okay, we're going to run some laps and make sure we um, cross the finish line in time. And I'm going to challenge myself in Mia's in the sex from the Fast and the Fury series. Yes, I do have. I didn't make that. I did. I didn't say that. That series is in my playlist. Um, you guys can go check that out if you want. It was very fun. Big thank you everyone for joining that series. But um, yeah, we are going to do a test drive in this car, specifically in the city. In um, special stage five on the channel, and um, I would do a do my drift. I do a drift video on my NSX, but I don't want to do that and show you guys the tune that was specifically made for me exclusively. So, that being said, uh, this car is fully race tuned for the track. We're going to score whatever time we can on Special Stage 5, Special Stage Route 5 on the channel. And, um, yeah, it's track circle stuff. I'll just keep ABS on for this segment of this episode, but, um, like I said, we're just going to give out our best lap times on free run and see what we can pull off. But uh, this is what we're running with right now with everything. This seems to be doable. I think I need a, need a little bit more camber in the front as far as this goes. Maybe a, maybe that much. I guess this will do. I'm not really going to mess with the toe. I don't, I don't really know. Like I don't know. This tune seems to be good for me or just for the car particularly but um i hope this is all doable for this episode yeah it's fully tuned no nitrous does not need it and racing soft tires like i said if you guys not new already subscribe hit the like button for our grand most six videos like this so we're gonna get started right now and um give give out our best times if you guys have a best time let me know in the comments down below and i hope you guys enjoy this video okay it's good so um been a little bit since I played this game just a little bit not even a week but I figured I go back to it and you know play it some more because you know it's been a while and we're gonna give we're gonna do our best times with different camera views and stuff like that like I said special stage route 5 this is probably one of my favorite this is this is one of my favorite tracks of all time and great turismo Press the wall, press into the wall. Oh my god, okay. So, that being said, this episode is just random. It's called Gran Turismo 6 Best Lap Time in a Sex. I almost really threw it down over there. But, uh, yeah. Try to score a better time on each lap in different camera views. See which one's comfortable for me. Oh my god. Yeah, that was terrible. And we got the ABS on, so we don't spin out of control as much. But it's helping a little bit more with the car, so it's not, like I said, sliding a lot. And we have, we also have racing soft tires, so we got more traction. I know the game is quiet, but I just want to capture the live commentary, because no one wants to hear, uh, Trash can shit. So, <laughs> sorry, but it's the truth though. It's Gran Turismo. Alright, we're gonna change our camera view to this camera view. Let's see what we can do. One minute, 22 seconds on the clock. We're gonna try to beat that time. Damn. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna miss it a little bit. Really trying to narrow down these corners. Wow, 
I lost so much time right there. Oh, I'm still in front. Sweet. Oh my god, come on. Yeah, I'm having a very hard time, apparently. I don't know why. I'm a shit driver right now. Damn. I'm not very impressed with that at all. We're still in the lead with the time. Not doing that bad. Damn, this car's a real bitch to turn. I'm not even sure if it's the camber tune, but I mean... Then again, I took the body roll down as well. Switch the camera view, the hood. Made it all the way up in the front. Lap three. Really narrowing it down. Oh shit, come on NSX, what are you doing? Hood view. We're a little bit behind. Okay. We should be able to catch up with my old time in no time. This thing really wants to pill out. I'm preventing it not to. That's the only issue I'm having with the NSX. This thing just wants to go. Let off. I'm really learning the balances of this track with this car. Alright, now we're going to try it in this camera view. Oh, man. This is probably the last camera view I don't even remember, but we're going to give it a shot. Okay. Oh, shit. Come on, you son of a bitch. See what I mean? It just wants to go. I'm not going to make a good time for this either. Yeah, like I said. Sometimes I have to let off the gas. Just to get around the corner. Oh my god, are you kidding me right now? Frustrating. What type of shit is that? Really? I got stuck? Five seconds behind. Yeah, I'm not the best in this camera view at all. I am shit in this camera view. I'm not a big fan of this camera view, guys. You, you know that. You know that for a fact. I can drift in this camera view, but racing? You know, I try to d dilate my eyes or whatever, die it down so I can have a best time. But it seems as though I am complete shit, so feel free to roast me in the comments. I'm a bad driver. It's okay because I can only get better. I'm gonna try this one more time. Let's see what I can do with the NSX. Yeah, look at that. Terrible. Want way too wide in that turn. I can get it done on that part. We're making good time so far. Trying to really, really, like I said, die it down. And easy on the throttle, but I, every time I get out of those turns, I just floor it. Wow. Okay, that was alright. 
I think we have one more camera view to go. I think that's it. I don't know. Alright, we're gonna try one more time. See what we can do. But this camera view. Okay, shit it. Come on. Yeah, I don't know why you did that, but that didn't help any at all. Bullshit! Okay. Six laps. Six laps. Could we make a better time? Possibly. Trying to make a better time. Oh yeah, we did make a better time. Wow. I don't know why it does that. Just the controller itself is stupid. So for each camera view, all the lap times are different. Best time, fifth lap, one minute, twenty-two seconds. One minute. 20 seconds in this camera view. Okay, so 1 minute 20 seconds with the assist on. Um, we're going to try it with it off. One time. Six laps. I guess different camera views. Let's give it a shot. Alright, now we should get a full handling of the car, obviously. But we gotta beat 1 minute and 20 seconds. Can we do that? Possibly. We're gonna do it in this camera view first, and then we're gonna switch up. Let's see how well we can do in these turns. Besides, freaking tap it a little bit. almost barely throwing it out of there so that doesn't happen we're a little bit behind but that's okay it's okay break that traction control really really I mean ABS really just kills it kills it for me but like I said, I got more control over the car now than I used to, and it definitely feels great. But we're behind. That's not great at all. Which you can see there's a big difference in the time gap. Am I impressed with my handle, uh, my driving? No. I'm terrible at my driving. I'm not impressed with it at all. Switching camera views. Next lap, let's go. One second behind. I don't even know if I'm gonna make it, to be honest. Because, like I said, the assists are off, and I'm trying my best. And then again, I'm shifting not at the right moments either. I'm trying not to spin out. Got a little bit of good time right there. Vitten the NSX from trying to freaking understeer. Or oversteer, sorry. Oversteer. Like crazy. That's what it wants to do. Shit. Okay. It's alright. It's all good. Yep, we were behind. Unfortunately, the assists are a lot better with the on because you get better lap times. And again, I'm just a shitty driver. Those are just my thoughts. But I got more control over over with the car with it off. But then again, it was probably my shifting and the way I was getting those apexes. Switching camera view again. Doing 
good. Going good right now. Nice and smooth through those corners. Not too bad, and we're making a better lap time. A little bit. Just trying to take these corners in nice and smooth without any problem. Over, understeer, oversteer again. Damn it. It's okay. I'm gonna try to make it through. It's not so bad though. Oh my gosh, see? Just a little bit bad on these turns, but uh, I'm very impressed with my driving as of right now. Just trying to get through today. That's all. Hope you guys enjoy your weekend. And uh, thanks for coming to the channel. But this video is not over yet. We still have one more camera review to do. Okay, so got one to go. We're going to see how well we do on this camera review. Then again, I hardly doubt I can do good. Really trying to keep the car from spinning out. Shit, man. Shit, shit, shit. Come on in, the sex. Yeah, I'm not doing. I'm doing pretty bad. The assist off, but it's to test my skill. See how much I can improve. And I'm not improving a lot. But I proved it a little bit with them off. As you can see by the time gaps. It's going back and forth. I didn't do too bad. I give myself some credit. Don't even do it. My ghost is right behind me. That was alright. That was alright. I'm done. I'm done for I'm done for the day. That's it. I'm finished for right now. This is Bullet Train HD guys. I hope you enjoyed this video today. Thanks for coming down to the channel and watching Gran Turismo 6. Me as time challenge. I forgot I say that anyway. But if you guys not know already, subscribe, hit that like button for more Gran Turismo 6 on the channel. And um I forgot to do something new for once. And um just Drop the NSX on a special stage 5. And, you know, since me as a street racer per se, uh, we try with ABS on and the ABS off. Big difference between the time gaps and overall my driving line. Now, all I have to do is just improve in that with, with the on or off. Or off, anyway. And as you can tell, don't use too much throttle, obviously, to get around the turns and the bends around. And, you know, brake a little bit early before you get to the turn. But you guys know the deal. But anyway, this is Bullet Train HD, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, subscribe if you're not new already. Um, big thank you, NSX, for letting me drive you and not completely lose control when no one got to hit a wall. I'll see you guys in the next video. All my links are down below. Until next